Amid the stirring words of Martin Luther King Jr. here at the Ruby and Calvin Fletcher African American History Museum in Stratford, where the imaginations of young children can take flight while opening doors to some of the most painful lessons in American history. To see this velvet rope and to see your dress, I mean, this is exciting. Yes. Living history is now on display in the form of Mary McBride Lee, the Bridgeport civil rights leader who was at the foot of the Edmund Pettus Bridge in Alabama on Bloody Sunday. She's the subject of the museum's newest permanent exhibit. McBride Lee says when it comes to this day, Juneteenth, its meaning and significance are of paramount importance. You know, it, it, it's our 4th of July, you know. We were liberated on this day in 1865. So uh, to me, it means, you know, freedom. Nobody knows more about the historical importance of freedom as it relates to the American Civil Rights Movement than Rita Daniels, great, great, great grandniece to iconic abolitionist leader Harriet Tubman. Daniels was in Bridgeport this weekend celebrating Juneteenth. Juneteenth is a time to celebrate and the reason why they call it Juneteenth is because many people did not know they were free. Some didn't find out for months or maybe even two years or more. Freedom is something that we fight for and we have to continue the fight. I am very very honored and happy to celebrate Juneteenth. Leora Levy of Greenwich is quick to point out People of all backgrounds are developing a deep appreciation and respect for the importance of Juneteenth as a great American holiday. As a young child, I saw the effects of prejudice and discrimination. Levy says she grew up down south during segregation, and by the time she was a teenager, she had grown to deplore racism and to embrace the supreme historic importance of June 19th, 1865. It was finally acknowledged that every, every American living here in the United States of America was free and entitled and given those rights by God. That's why I'm celebrating. Three women with very different backgrounds all celebrating today a very special local, state and federal holiday, one providing people of diverse backgrounds with common ground on this Juneteenth. 2022. I'm glad about that. In Bridgeport, Frank Reckia, News 12, Connecticut.